breaking news again. I found the slave ships. As you can see here, the USS Patricia is a transatlantic slave liner. And as you can see here, it was a bunch of people up on that liner. But as you can see here, this is another picture of that liner, but it don't look like ain't no melanated people on that thing. That just begs the question, what was they talking about when they said they brought 12 million slaves here? So it got me to thinking, who are the slaves? And as you can see here, the slaves are Slavic people, not melanated people. So when they said they brought 12 million slaves here, they wasn't lying. They just changed these people's identity. As you can see here and here, they look like some of the people we know as Native Americans today, don't they? Because as you can see here, they were shipping those people in here and giving them our land. And as you can see here, no passports or visas were needed to enter the United States through Ellis Island. In fact, no papers were required at all. And we all have seen this picture. But you didn't know that that's a transatlantic slave boat that brought 12 million slaves here. It had three tiers, upper class, middle class, and lower class. And this is the owner of that boat. So basically they just let these people get on a boat over in Europe with no paperwork or nothing, just said verbally who they was. And then they came over to America under indentured servitude or slavery. They created different wars that tore up the melanated towns. And now those towns are mostly sundown towns. What's funny is now it's a hundred years later and their offspring are the same people who saying, close the border and we need a wall. They're your regular modern day Karens out here telling people to go back to their country. But as you can see here, I have plenty of literature and real time pictures of y'all on slave boats. I have yet to see y'all produce any of these types of pictures with us on slave boats or that we were ever called slaves in history, in your story. And as you can see here, that's really just the people y'all documented. So if it says 12 million, it was more like 20 million, maybe 25. So it looked like the upper class Europeans carried the East Asian with them here because they were planning on giving them our lands. They knew what they were doing. They had already cleared out the whole coast. Now they wanted to move their own people in there for their own political power. Like you still see them doing today. And as you can see here, it says they have first, second, and third class passengers. It even shows the examination that they were going through. I would love for y'all to show pictures of us getting examined coming here on slave ships. Because I know for a fact that the Africans had malaria and malaria didn't get here until the 1500s. And most of us on this landmass never got malaria. 
Peace to the gods.